now. Is this y'all first time here? This is my second time. Yeah. I was in the back back the first time. Uh, plus one. Talk, wow, plus one. <laughs> now you plus whoever. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Seven o'clock. On the dot. <laughs> hey, guess what I've been saying all day, though? Biatch! What's up, everybody? It's Ray J. Not just Ray J. I'm like everybody's favorite cousin. Big cousin, little cousin, it don't matter. But I'm giving you the exclusive backstage pass to the 2024 BET Awards. Now, back here, we can talk to the presenters. We can talk to the performers. And you just you just don't know. It's going to be a lot of surprises. And what better person to be back here than me, Ray, to ask them whatever you want to know. This is Backstage 2024 BET Awards. Welcome. What's up, everybody? It's Ray J. Like I said, man, we are going to meet with the biggest artist behind the scenes backstage. Tyla is here. Congratulations. You just won a big award. How does it feel? I was literally caught off guard. Guys, I did not prepare anything, but I just want to say thank you so much to my Tigers, my family, my team. Thank you to BT for always pushing the culture. Come on. I feel amazing, honestly. Um, my first time at the BET Awards. First time? First time, so I'm- now, I was gonna ask you what kind of memorable moment you had here, but is there a, a moment that you always remember here, it, now that you're a winner, before the winning, is there a moment for you? Just all the performances really, like that's what keeps me hooked. Yeah, yeah. that's what's up. And I'm so proud of you and everything that you're doing. What's next? Is it movies? Is it more music? Is it touring? Uh, definitely more music, touring. Gonna be around for a long time, so. I love your interviews. I love what you do. All y'all guys that's trying to get with her, leave her alone. She's trying to be professional and she's just trying to do her job. That's it. Chandler Moore. There we go. How was it, man? It was amazing. Blessings, bro. I'm back. I'm backstage just making sure I tap in. I'm backstage just making sure I tap in with with all the performers. Uh, how did, how was it? I mean, that's mega. Will you? BET Awards. Well, I'm just glad you're talking to a legend. Oh, you're a legend. Man, I'm just chilling. I'm paying my dues. I'm honored, but Will, man, I was glad to be a part of a moment that was so significant for him. Uh, first time he's done music in a while, and personal journey, I know it meant a lot, but for me, it meant a lot of being on my own personal. So glad to encourage fellow people in the industry and just have a moment of inspiration for sure. Dude, it was big. I saw Will. I said, Will, Will, can I get you? They said, he busy. You know what I'm saying? But maybe you can put in a good word. Just tell yes, him sir. I said, what's up? Thank you. But I'm proud of you. Thank you. Keep putting out that word, keep Thank inspiring. You, and, and you know, we, anytime you want to come back and holler yeah, at us, we'll here. be back all night. Get down on the road and you feel the I know you can make it. What's up, y'all? We backstage. It's 2024 BET Awards. I'm here with my brother, the legend, Too Short. You get what I'm saying? Like, this is my bro. Everybody in hip hop has used this man's phrases. <laughs> What's my favorite word? Yeah. Why they gotta say it like short? Yeah. You know they can't play on my court. You can't hang with the big dog stay at the court. You blow the whistle. I heard that like I, I performed and just went cut straight to the awards. So it was like, um, like I, I set the show up or something, you know? You set it up. I mean, you too short. Like you got some of the biggest records and the biggest songs and the biggest phrases of all my time. At this point in my career, man, it's always amazing to step in front of a young crowd and give them that energy and they just love it. It's just like, you know, I, I'm way past the, uh, my expectation for what this career could be. Man, I'm 30 something years in this thing and still rocking crowds and still being invited and still being, you know, a big dog in the game. Isn't God good? It is great that God has blessed us with this talent, bruh. It is really good and I, I, I plan on always continuing to do what I'm supposed to do with it and that's to give it back, pass it on, give the next person the opportunity, man, and always just keep keep our thing going, man. This hip-hop R&B thing, keep it going. So listen, we was just talking about the number one record that's out right now. You just performed mm -hmm. it. How did it feel? <laughs> the is in the building too, man, Jesus. Uh, talk about the music game where it is today, and when when you're successful now, what is that? What does that mean? Performing for the BET Awards like that, man, it means a lot. It means that you, you know, you broke through the phone, man. You broke through the internet. You know, it's this internet stuff, but it's like real life. You know what I mean? The people doing the dances and the TikToks is all great, but it's cool to just see real people and it's happening in a real way and it's touching so many different communities. And Absolutely. it's great to see people come together. You know? Now, is this y'all first time here? It's my second time. Second time. I was in the back, back the first time. Though. Back the first time on stage. The <laughs> I was second in the time. Back, yeah. Talk about that. Plus talk, one. Talk. Wow. Plus one. <laughs> now you plus whoever. Yeah. Right. 
Talk about fast the elevation moment. of that because you see how it can change that fast, but it's not really fast because of all the work yeah, you put in work. before. Mm-hmm. And some, sometimes people forget that it took a while, yeah. but it seemed like it was just yesterday. Yeah, I mean, like my brother here, man, I was, you know, when I was putting out the song and when we connected, I went and watched some of his documentaries and I heard about his story, man. We, we worked, you know, we really, really worked. We sacrificed a lot, you know, moving from home to chase our dreams and not knowing what, what was going to happen next. It's like you make those sacrifices and hope to get a return like this. You know? Yeah, I mean, I mean this. think about all the music artists that want to be big. You know, you in the studio, then you get lost in the sauce. You're not answering your phone. <laughs> and then sometimes they don't make it like that, but they sometimes they put in the work. So it is a blessing. Do you guys have any favorite BET award moments? See, yeah, favorite favorite BET award moments? Anything. Right. <laughs> Period. That's what I'm talking about. Period. <laughs> BET. Make some noise for Mr. Tipsy himself. sure we, we touched on that so they yeah. knew the elevation of it are y'all gonna actually do some new records together yeah, ooh, that's, 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 good, yeah, that's a good question you know they got studios out here y'all might as well go after this and knock a couple out you feel me <laughs> that's what's up man well i just wanted to congratulate both of y'all wow man like i'm we all watching it happen in real time and continued success and man y'all could do a song with brandy with that tone and some, so i'm saying give brandy some of those like joints she ain't here but she she gonna see this though what's one of your favorite bet awards moments because you said that sometimes it might be up or down for you what's the one that stands out the most well honestly i love that will smith his first time performing mm-hmm. um whitney houston yes um, I don't know. I got so many. Oh, you I tapped in. BET. Listen, Come you tapped on, in. Like, you what? just tapped in. Yeah, I'm like, so yeah. All right, let me hit you with this. It's seven o'clock on the dot. I'm in my drop top, cruising the street. Hey, oh uh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> then, so you know, you know it. Oh, Talk about on. Usher. Talk about the award he's getting tonight. I mean, all the work he's put in. First of all, Usher is a friend. His wife is a friend. His family is a friend of ours. Um, and it's phenomenal for him to get his flowers is exceptionally beautiful to watch we all grew up on usher i don't care if you black white mexican asian it doesn't matter, yeah, it doesn't matter. you he is so multicultural. it's incredible to watch to feel to make love to to run to to hoop to to get down to to play to, to, to hoop to yeah, playing hoops too. Damn, we went yeah, from hoop to getting usher. it popping and shooting basketball <laughs> wait and i get it cracking oh, yeah no it gets me. First of all, I hooped. Not only was I just a white, I hooped. So, okay. come on now. Listen, we are backstage. I'm with the beautiful, my friend, family, Megan Good. How are you? I'm doing good, your, brother. How you my, doing? I'm doing good. We running around trying to make sure we talk to everybody and get everybody's like, you know, uh, just just their emotions on the BET Awards. How you feeling today? Amazing. How's Man, the awards? How, how you, how's the experience? It's been incredible. Like literally everybody who's come out has killed it. Who's like, it's, everybody's been standing, clapping, and dancing, doing the whole thing. and. It's just been a really, really beautiful night of us in the culture. Now talk about Usher getting a Lifetime Achievement Award. Oh, it's seven o'clock. On the dot, I'm in my drop top, cruising the streets. Dang, dang, dang. You know what I'm saying? I got I can keep going. Nah, anyway, you good, you good, because um, it's going to start getting a little, Usher start to, yeah, he yeah. start to tap and in. Yeah, start, yeah, the same things. Um, I'm so happy for him, you know, it's so well deserved and, and, um, it's just a beautiful thing to see people get their flowers while they're here. Yeah. You know, yeah. and to celebrate people and to celebrate black men and just to celebrate the culture. But Usher is a huge part of the culture. Yeah. So I it's agree. a beautiful thing. Yeah. Talk about your favorite BT it's like moment you think about when you think of the awards. I mean you've seen them, I've seen them. Monique coming out with the uh oh uh uh oh, uh uh look. Whoa, she was that's doing a Beyonce. first. Listen, she was doing that thing, 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 thing. Mon- that, that ass, she was getting it, she wasn't getting she? It. She, she was, was getting, getting it. it. Yeah. That's what's up. Monique, what up? Love you. What's next for you? 
Uh, Divorce in the Black comes out July 11th on Amazon Prime with my brother Corey. Wow. Uh, Harlem Season 3 is coming back. Wow. Uh, I also have a film that I directed for TPS Studios. I'm the first director out of this initiative that he basically said, look, here are the funds to shoot the movie that you want to shoot. Uh, Terrence J produced it with me. We co-starred it together. Get him, Terrence. Uh, it's my directorial debut solo, so I'm I'm very, very happy and blessed, and Mr. Perry is an angel, so. Tyler, what's up? Yeah, we love you. You know I'm right here, baby. All right. <laughs> look, he gonna call you. You know I do Ratchet TV, so. It's a little different. Stop. But um, I'll, I'll continue success. Thank you. It's good to see you. You too. You know, we've been working since we was little together. Ten. We've known each other Ten since years we were old, ten. right? And so, family, I'm happy to see you here. You know, we are all surviving successfully. Amen. It's the biggest backstage show of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Angela Black China White. How are you? How you doing, Ray? I'm good. You How know, it's you? always good to see people that do what I do too. And, I, and, and even though you might not be, you might be done with reality. I love it so much. You know? I'm, not, I'm not done with reality. Oh, you're not? Okay. No, I just did College Hill. Oh, yeah. Come and that's on, BET. Ray. Stop playing. Did you see my picture in there? Okay, so that was you. It, it was me after they said it was me. I promise you, because even when I walked in, I was like, my soul Ray. was still there. You presented the award today. Yes, the Her Talk award. about it, the Her Award. Yes, it was really good. Me and the, the cast of College Hill. Okay. We all went up there and we presented the Her Award. Wow, I wasn't there. Yeah. I didn't, they didn't give me, I'm the cat. I'm just playing. No, that's <laughs> I'm just sad. talking with you. So, so, let's talk about Usher. It's yes. seven o'clock on the dot. I'm in my drop top, cruising the street. All the women know I it. Got a friend, the, friend, the, friend, the, friend, we doing an album? I pull up, anticipating good love. Don't keep me waiting. I, I got, got plans. plans to put my hands in places I never seen. Girl, you know what I mean. <laughs> I, I felt like I sound good. Give me no, some you sounded sleep. good. You sounded angelic, just like the dress. Okay, I was. I couldn't you stop know? either. It just and took I me. wouldn't have stopped you. I would not okay. have stopped you. It just took me. We having fun. Thank <laughs> you for thank you for stopping by. Thank you. Congratulations on all the success. College thank Hill you. season three. Oh my God. Woo, it's coming, coming, coming. Ray, I'm proud of you. Thank you. You're so I, dope. I just try to stay stay above water and just stay over here in my you lane. You're a real definition of a real hustler. And I Thank just you. love that because a real hustler recognizes it. And it's, it's a difference between hustling and grinding and doing this. Your your entrepreneurship is like, is up there. And Thank I you. really admire that about you. Thank you so much. I love. This is the BET Awards Backstage Pass. I'll see you soon.